this is me being nosy at my Walmart. I noticed all of these containers um, are all in this one little corner of the parking lot. Um, and let's see, they go back there. There's one here. This right here is new. I'm gonna go peek up there. I have no idea what's in there, but although it looks like there might be some trash there. So we'll see about that. There's some more here. And this looks like some kind of an office for Walmart. Maybe it's classrooms because it has this little graduation cap right there on the door. This one right here, that one says hazardous. That's interesting. It's got some flags on it. Anyway, I wonder what's going on here. Okay, so there's waste in there. I see metals. Boxes in there. I wonder why. I wonder why. This is there. This is taking up quite a bit of parking lot space. This did not use, this was not here last week. And there's some more. There's another view of the containers over there. Hmm. Very interesting. Like, do they not have room for all the trash or something? Like, is this from all the overstock? Let's go in and see what they got going on today. Okay, all of this is different right here. This whole aisle section has changed and where I'm looking straight ahead, this is completely different. It was, that whole area was open back there and it was the garden center. So we're gonna peek back there. Oh yeah, this is all different. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. What is going on? Okay, here's a bunch. Oh, tons of clearance. Oh my gosh. Tons of clearance down these aisles. You are, I remember seeing these candles. Garden flag. <laughs> Sorry, I had to, people were behind me. Okay, now this was all the garden center before. Um, this is all toys now. I have never seen that much stock up top before. So this garden center goes outside, like outside of the building. We still have summer, summer pool stuff is on clearance. This is more stuff for, this is bird seed. Oops. And then this area out here. Oh. So I did hear a notice on the news this morning um, about uh, Walmart canceling a bunch of orders for the fall because they have way too much stuff. And it's fairly obvious that they have a way too much stuff because nobody can afford it. This area is lighting, that's different. Okay, here's another clearance area back here. And let's see, are these items clearance? No, but looky here. Look at all these Brita pictures. Water dispensers with the jugs. Too bad these aren't on clearance. <laughs> Oh, here we go. There's some changes. 
I have never seen this many bikes in Walmart. Oh my gosh. They're all down on the floor too. I'm trying to look inconspicuous, you guys, so I apologize. Lots of stock, lots of boxes here. Oh, this is completely different if you look ahead. What is going on back here? All of this here in the back corner, this was automotive and they've moved it now to the sidewall. The sidewall that goes all the way on the back. So down that way, and that's all automotive and things for your, you know, your vehicles. There's wiper fluids, some oil, more automotive over there. And here, this is all cleaned out. Here's the tire department. There's some hunting. So now this is the outdoor section has moved in the back corner. Okay, here's athletics. Oh my gosh, this is all different. Oh, there's some changes up ahead too. More stock. There are boxes everywhere. Lots of hunting stuff has come in. Fishing. Okay, no movies. No DVDs. No entertainment for y'all. Just the movies on this side. No bestsellers. No movies A to Z. We have TDs. Oh, here's a movie bin. Video games. Slim pickens. Trampolines. Anybody want a trampoline for Christmas? Mm, that's all empty over there. There's always usually something right here, but not today. Wow, lots of futons. Let's check out the shoes. Last time I was here, the shoes were not looking good. Here's the men's shoes. Kids' shoes, ladies' shoes. There's more here. Ooh, I wonder if they have the shoes that I'm wearing. They do. I should get a red pair. some boots. I'm starting to get some fall wear in. No, I have no idea what this is. I'm back here in the dairy department. <laughs> so, it's wood. It's hard structure. in this freezer refrigerator unit. This is just really creepy, you guys. This thing right here, oh my gosh. Look at the milk, it's all stocked up. $3.98 for one. The two pack is gone. Oh no, there's one back there. to lunch meat because I forgot to put it on my Walmart order but look wait a minute I just came by here and I saw these bricks of cheese for two dollars I think we're gonna have to get some oh yeah lunch meat lunch meat where are you lunch meat oh not a lot of lunch meat okay so the ones that we're getting is, oh Lord. All right, well, I guess we are gonna get turkey breast today. 
there isn't any ham. Chicken looks good today. 278 a pound. No, 294 a pound. Oh boy. Let's see what the freezer section looks like. I wonder if they were able to find anything in my order. I'm stocking down there in the freezer section. Produce. Looks pretty good. Some bananas that look fairly decent as well. Mason jars. I've never seen them here before. Okay, these are $14.97 for the 12 ounce um, jars. The quart jars, sorry, the 12 ounce. What am I saying? <laughs> the only reason I'm in here inside Walmart is because my pickup order was delayed. And I said, well, I needed to get a couple things that I, could, I didn't add to my order anyway like dog food. Got my dog food. Plus I got some other things. So this is just dangerous. Keep coming in and I spend more money. <laughs> and the fall, this is in a different area as well. But they put all the fall here, right next to the grocery. This usually is over, I don't know, four more aisles. This is where all the back to school stuff was. So they moved that over here. They've been busy. Well, they really crammed it all in here too. But everybody, if you're in Virginia, I'm sorry, if you're not from Virginia, um, our kids have gone, our kids, meaning our Virginia kids have gone back to school last week. Um, so be interesting to see if this stuff goes on clearance. This, um, this, there's not usually this much room. All right, I'm going to go to a scan and go checkout because y'all know I tell you to go ahead and do these things. Check yourself out so you don't have to wait in long lines. Let's see, here's a rotisserie chicken. Ooh, I should get one of these. you guys I'm back in the car and I can talk normally what did you think of what was going on in the store wasn't that interesting it could be just remodeling like everybody says but it could be that they're making room for all of the overstock that they have now I was starting to say in the store but I couldn't really get out complete sentences I heard that Walmart had made an announcement that they were canceling future orders like future orders for the fall Christmas because they have so much stock and so driving there today and driving around the parking lot and seeing all those extra shipping containers I'm sure are full of storage and then you saw just all of the boxes and in stock inside the store um, these people are just working their hineys off trying to um, get that stock out on the shelves yeah, this is really, really interesting. It, it really does make sense that all of this stuff that now they're just getting, it, it, it's all arriving. They have no place to put it. Um, I drove around the back of Walmart and there were three uh, semi trailers backed up to the general merchandise area. Now there were only three bays, so they were full, um, but I, they didn't have, um, you know, a truck attached to them. It's just the trailer. Then there was one Walmart truck that uh, was pulled up off to the side with you know truck and trailer attached together and that was waiting I guess for an opening and then on the other side was grocery loading only and that had one trailer in it and from what I could tell walking around the store most of our area as far as groceries goes was not bad looking um, we've had more chicken there today than we've had in a long time the beef area so I'm starting to see um, ground beef roasts you know sliced steaks things like that that was on the slow on the slim picking side today um, I'm starting to see a shift change is coming y'all okay let me know what's going on in your Walmarts because are you are you seeing lots of remodeling are you seeing strange things happening are you seeing lots of uh, storage containers out back all the trash 
now that I've been walking around the store, I saw that the area for trash, they just are just going through so much trash, they need to have extra dumpsters uh, to put all that stuff. So that is going to be very interesting. Um, if it wasn't under surveillance, I would be tempted to just walk in there and snoop around and see what's in those trash cans. But this one was fun to go walking around the store and seeing what was there. So y'all take care, be aware, and in prayer. I'll catch you in the next video.